You've got this, babe. Thanks, sweetie. I'm proud of you. It's 20 rows, two people, Chan. Wait, is it direct? Yeah. Lucy's gonna be in Milwaukee tomorrow. I'll be on the flight 24 hours from now. My heart hurts, I think. Coffee? Thanks, honey. Oh, gosh. You didn't want to show everybody your face routine? <laughs> Welcome to our last day together before we do long distance marriage. Today's gonna be a funny vlog because I think it's just gonna be us being a little emo sad the whole day. Today is a very rainy day here in New York City. Cheers. I'm doing laundry. Lucy is packing. Whew. And we're feeling it. It is really hard to know what to bring for two months. There's just so many possibilities of like random auditions I could get while I'm there that I would like need certain outfits or dance shoes for, things like that. So I'm trying to like count the cost of if it's worth it to bring all those things. We're staying in a hotel for the first two weeks that we're there. So food, especially being gluten and dairy free, might be tricky. So I'm trying to like prepare and bring stuff so I can like make shift a kitchen when there's not a kitchen. I asked Chandler if I could bring this. Just a little picture of us. Whoa. I think I might put it next to my bedside table until the show starts and then I'll put it at my desk at the show so I can remember. I can remember you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You might forget. What are you doing? Well, I just found a reservation for us for tonight. Amazing. How are you feeling? I'm feeling unwell. Really? I feel like I want to take my mind off things. I'm going to do the laundry, maybe listen to a podcast. Okay, so you might be thinking like, what's the game plan here? Lucy's leaving. Am I gonna go visit? Are we just not gonna see each other? I don't know. I feel like we haven't answered any of those questions. So I am visiting. I'm visiting once in November, which I'll be there for like a week. The furthest we'll be apart from each other is like a four week time span. We're being dramatic, but like that's so doable. I'm gonna be working full time still as well. During the process, adjusted hours during the rehearsals. And then once the shows start, fairly normal hours. So yeah, I really do think it'll fly by for me. Ta -da. You're gonna be gone for two months. How many bags do you think you're gonna need? I need more than these two, but I have to just limit myself to these two. So this is all I got. Okay, while well, Lucy continues to pack, I just wanted to give some appreciation to the subscribers to our channel. Aw, that's sweet. The comments on our last video yeah. were just so outrageously kind. It just made me so thankful for just the little, little carved out niche of YouTube that we have right now and express our gratitude for y'all. It was just so encouraging. I'm wondering if I should like read some of these. Yeah. Kim says, first of all, if there's one couple that can do this, it's you two. You got this all day long. Oh, and the rest of that comment was cute too. She said, second of all, you're thinking of this all wrong. It's not a long distance marriage. It's just away on a business trip. So cute. Thank you guys for believing in us and for believing in Lucy pursuing her dreams. I just think this is gonna be such an amazing thing for her and for her career. This is really like bringing us back to when we had to do long distance for, we did long distance for a year and a half, but this is where she's at in her packing state. We had to decide between a few things that probably just couldn't fit, but I'm a little worried as to whether this large bag is gonna close. This one is kind of overflowing. It is almost time for our reservation. We're kind of matching, Lou. We are. Should I change? <laughs> no, I'm done packing. I need to see if the bags will zip up, but we have to go to dinner. We're running very late, so. Very late. I am doing it for urgency. <laughs> We gotta go to dinner. We will try when we get back. Lucy's umbrella broke. We are now under just one. I'm not a, I really, I love it. I love it this way. She loves it this way. <laughs> Dessert hall. But just for Chandler. 
vegan chocolate. Well, you could have gotten something. No, but I like, let's continue the saga of Chandler's feeling bad for himself. That's funny. Vegan chocolate chip cookie, vegan cookie dough ice cream, slightly melted. That's a long story. <laughs> Delicious. So if any of you have more long distance advice, let us know in the comments below. And to those of you who are worried, you're thinking Lou and Chan channel without Lou and Chan together, what's this gonna be? Super valid, hey, super valid. You're not alone. I'm sure there's other people thinking the same thing, but don't worry, the vlogs will still be coming. Yeah, I feel like we need to do the zip up test. No, but I wish we had a scale so we could weigh it. Doesn't Delta have like a 60 pound limit rather than a 50? I think that's probably like certain statuses. I'm definitely not that status. <laughs> Oh, really? Oh my gosh, yes. You think it might be over 50? Are you trying to do what you do at the gym? I'm trying to like visualize what a 50 pound dumbbell feels like. <laughs> I think it'll be 50 pounds, maybe 51. It has come to that dreadful part of the night, the time where we have to go to sleep, which means tomorrow our goodbye is closely approaching. I hope this vlog hasn't been uh, too depressing. But honestly, it's a really good take into like who we are is depressing. And also like- <laughs> What? <laughs> oh. No, I just mean we're emo. We're so emo. Like when- We I take things seriously. We yeah. do take things seriously. See you in five weeks. Four. Four weeks. And then another four weeks. I think the second leg will be easier. Currently 5.46. Let's make some coffee. Somehow time in the morning just gets eaten up so quickly. Oh, are you sad vibes? I know, I just I just showed them the time and it was like 5.45 and now it's 6.26. Lucy's leaving in like four minutes. So sad. I'm gonna miss you so much. Oh, you got this, babe. Thanks, sweetie. I'm proud of you.